Okay, we look like we're good. I'm going to start today's family webinar. So um, for the perfect destinations and hotels for your family clients, I'm going to let Anna introduce herself. Anna, hello. Hi, I'm Anna Wells. I'm Director of Whirlwind Marketing, um, looking after Blue Waters Resort and Spa in Antigua and the Landings Resort and Spa in St Lucia. Our price today is £50 and $60. Brilliant. Thank you, Anna. Um, we've also got Jade. Jade, hello. Everybody, I'm Jade, uh, business development. No, let's try that again. <laughs> business development manager with Fire Hotels and Resorts. And today I'm going to be talking about the lovely Hilton Rose Hall in Jamaica. Mm. And our price will be fifty pounds or your rose or sixty dollars. Super. Thank you very much, Jade. And we've also got the lovely Graham. Graham, hello. Hello, hello. Welcome to everybody um, to this fantastic MBR uh, seminar. I'm uh, giving away fifty pounds today in hard-earned cash. Well, brilliant. Yeah. And where are you from today, Graham? I am from, I'm the owner of Passion About Travel, um, which we look after several hotels throughout the Caribbean. And it's so good to be in the, in the Caribbean um, webinar. Brilliant. And your hotels today are? It is very impressive. It's the impressive uh, resorts and spa in beautiful Dominican Republic. Super duper. So we're going to hear today all about the family offerings available um, for your clients. So Anna, you're going to kickstart us. You're going to take us to St. Lucia and Antigua. Over to you. Hi, everyone. So um, today I'm going to start with um, Blue Waters Resort and Spa in Antigua and tell you everything about families and Blue Waters. So the first um, reason why you should come to um, Blue Waters as a family is we have simple protocols to get into Antigua. It's no test, uh, pre-arrival test to come into Antigua now for unvaccinated travellers. And for children aged five and over, it is one simple uh, rapid antigen test taken no more than one day prior to arrival. When you get to Antigua, it's very, very easy to get through the airport. You can be at Blue Waters within an hour. I've just done it. It's very quick. We're in a great location, just 15 minutes from Antigua VC Bird Airport. So the second reason is that we have seven ocean view swimming pools. Great for families, plenty of space to spread out. We also have an adults only pool. So for time without the children, you can head up there. We've got the double day beds up there, beautiful views over the ocean. And Carolyn's Beach Pool is perfect for children because it's very shallow, safe for swimming as well there. We then got four further cove suite pools, which I'll move on to in a second. It's all premium family accommodation. So we actually removed our superior hillside rooms from the inventory and we now lead in with our deluxe beachfront rooms. The great thing about these rooms is that a lot of them do interconnect. So they're perfect for families traveling with children that want that separate sleeping space. We are one of the few resorts in the Caribbean that do guarantee that at booking stage if it's available. They've all been renovated in the last few years as well and they all steps down to the ocean, beautiful ocean views from there. Then we have the luxurious cove suites, just a short five minute stroll from the main resort. These will sleep up to two adults and two children or up to three adults. And I would recommend that if you are a family traveling with small children, do request a ground floor suite. It just means that the parents can make use of the swimming pool whilst the children may be napping throughout the day if you've got young children. The, the cove suites do come complete with the um, exclusive cove suite pools. So these are exclusive for our cove suite guests and also our cove concierge service, which is a WhatsApp service. So they can literally just message anything they need throughout the day from restaurant reservations to spa reservations. All of our cove suites are housed in cove villas of six cove suites and a beautiful three bedroom penthouse at the top. So the three bedroom cove penthouses, they're all ensuite bathrooms, three bedrooms with ensuite bathrooms. These will sleep up to 10, so they're perfect for larger families traveling together. They've got stunning views of the ocean, and as they're at the top of the cove villa, they really do tower over the ocean there. We've got kitchen facilities, so we can actually organize a private chef within the um, cove penthouses as well. And all of our cove penthouses come complete with a VIP arrival service at Antigua Airport, private return resort transfers, and our villa, um, concierge manager who is Nicole she will do anything for your guests prior to their arrival from grocery shopping to organizing any restaurant reservations and spa treatments we then have the three in the six bedroom pelican house if you take all six bedrooms that will sleep up to 18 guests so that really is a perfect option for multi-generational families traveling together you then get the exclusive uh, pelican pool exclusive beach access and our villa manager in there as well all of our villas have um, kitchen facility and um, dining space. We can actually organize a private chef in all of our villas there. We've got the four bedroom turtle cottage. It's four and a half thousand square foot of open plan living space, private pool, four ensuite bedrooms. So this will sleep up to 12 in turtle cottage, all overlooking the ocean, absolutely stunning views of the ocean there from turtle. 
And then lastly, we've got the four bedroom rock cottage. So it's got its own infinity pool in the middle, a further plunge pool at the front, and it's also got a commercial kitchen. So actually you don't need to leave rock cottage at all throughout your stay. You can have all of your meals prepared for you down at rock. Um, it's all surrounded by water. It's absolutely stunning. You've got the semi private beach there to the left. It's got its own jetty as well. So you can actually moor boats up at rock cottage there too. Dining and entertainment, we've got three wonderful restaurants. We've got the Palm All Day Dining Restaurant, which is open for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. We've got Carolyn's Beach Restaurant, which is open most days for lunch. And then we've also got the Cove Restaurant, which is voted one of the most romantic restaurants in Antigua. All of our restaurants do take children as well. We have early dining options from 6 p.m. They're all part of the all-inclusive program as well. So the only additionals would be like our, our um, connoisseurs menu which is like a ten dollar supplement for certain items on the menu but the majority of items are included in there as well we have two meal plans it's bed and breakfast and all inclusive we do find about 80 percent of our guests do come on all inclusive antigua does have some wonderful restaurants across the island but you've always got to jump in a taxi or hire a car so our all inclusive meal plan is very very popular it's very comprehensive it includes all meals it includes drinks it includes cocktails wines and beers by the glass it also includes a daily restocked minibar so the Blue Waters Kids Club, fantastic program that we've got there, led by our kids club manager Ainsley, who's been with us um, since the beginning of the year. She actually came from Curtin Bluff, she, where she was there for 15 years, but she's absolutely fantastic. My kids didn't want to leave the kids club this time around, so they absolutely loved it. So she does fishing trips, she does arts and crafts, she does sports. We have um, bouncy castles in the kids club garden. So there's so many different activities for the kids to enjoy from ages five up to 12. So you can see some of the recent kids activities at Easter. We had 50 children in house over Easter. So really, really popular time. And the kids all had such a wonderful time. We did Easter egg hunts and lots of different activities. We also offer activities during the evening as well. So it means that the parents can sometimes enjoy a meal uh, by themselves and the kids can be taken care of. Experiences for all ages. We've got non-motorized water sports from sailing to paddle boards to kayaks. We offer sailing tuition and we also offer kayak excursions there as well. We actually turned our old restaurant Bartley's into a games room. So it's pool tables, table tennis, games, console um, and board games in there as well. Perfect hangout for teens. And then for some me time, we've got a full service spa with four treatment rooms and a couple's treatment room. We've got the exclusive pool overlooking the cliff top there, yoga, pilates, we've got hikes, we've got garden tours with our head gardener, um, John. We also offer things like rum tasting and wine tasting there as well. We also have a full service gym with brand new Cybex equipment in there as well. Activities in Antigua for families, there's loads to do on the island. I definitely recommend heading down to Shirley Heights on a Sunday evening. We can organise all the transport down there for the bar barbecue and the steel pan. You can go swimming with the stingrays, you can go off-road buggying, you can do zip wiring, so perfect for those older children uh, coming to the island as well. And just a short video.
now whisking you off to the beautiful island of St Lucia in the second property that I represent, which is the Landings Resort and Spa, a five star family resort on the north coast of St Lucia. So again, we have simple protocols to come into St Lucia for vaccinated arrivals, you don't require a pre arrival test. And for for children aged five and over, um, you do require one simple PCR test taken within five days of arrival, there is no quarantine when you get there so that has all been removed. We're in a fantastic location set on the north coast of St Lucia, just a short five minute um, uh, transfer over to Pigeon Island National Park. We've also got plenty of different excursions going across the north of the island, so it really is a great base. Just a five minute taxi ride down to Rodney Bay there with its shops, bars and restaurants as well. So as you can see, we are set in a marina. A lot of people think that we don't have a beach, that we are a marina resort. We're actually a marina resort with a fantastic beach. We've got one of the best beaches on St Lucia. But the great thing about the marina is that you've all of our um, accommodations overlook the water, whether it be a marina view, an ocean view or a beach view there. Fantastic facilities. We've got four pools, including a kids pool, which you can see in the top left here, which is very shallow, safe for swimming. We've got the beautiful 800 feet of white sand beach. It's crystal clear water, white sand, absolutely perfect for swimming. And we've got the marina there. So it's spacious villa suites with views of the water. As you can see here, you've got absolutely stunning views of the water. Some of them do have plunge pools as well, which is a great bonus for, for families traveling with children. 85, one, two and three bedroom villa suites. So when you're looking at the price point of St Lucia and the landings, do bear in mind that we lead in from villa suite. We don't lead in from a room. So it's 950 square foot is our lead in villa suite category, right the way up to our three bedroom grand villa, which will sleep up to seven guests, which is 2,300 square foot. All of our villa suites have ensuite uh, bathrooms. So perfect for families, larger families traveling together, full designer kitchens. So we can actually organize private chefs in all of our villa suites. They can convert to king or twin beds in every single room, full living spaces, and also the added bonus of a full size washer dryer in every single villa suite, perfect for families. So you can see very contemporary bedrooms, beautiful views, open plan living space overlooking the ocean. So this is the beachfront block. And then we have beautiful contemporary bathrooms as well with a separate uh, shower, separate bath. And as you can see, the balconies are really, really spacious. We've got a dining space on the balcony as well. So if you do organize a private chef to come into your villa suite, you can actually have the dining space on the balcony there. So we have experiences and activities for all ages. There's lots going on at the landings. We've got two floodlit tennis courts and we can actually organize a tennis pro to come in and do coaching. We have uh, non-motorized water sports. We have glass bottom kayaks. We have sailing, we have paddle boards. Again, we offer tuition there as well. And for older children, we do have the option of motorized water sports, which are just a small surcharge. We offer water skiing. We offer the great big marble ride. And we also offer tuition uh, with the water skiing as well. Families and kids programs. So there's so much to do for children. Our kids program is for ages four to 12. It's run by Aunt Kathy. She's absolutely fantastic. Very enthusiastic. She's always around the resort going to see our children. You can see my children up there with the Cookie Monster having a great time at the landings recently. They loved the kids club there. So many different activities inside and outside the kids club, including uh, beach trips down. We do fishing, uh, we do arts and crafts. Um, so yeah, lots going on. And again, we also offer evening activities. Um, so to give parents a bit of downtime. For the teens and the tweens, again, as I said, we offer tennis, we offer the motorized water sports, we offer the water sports tuition, um, there's uh, hammocks, there's volleyballs, there's so much going on for those older children as well. And, and do bear in mind that we are just five minutes from Rodney Bay with all of its shops, bars and restaurants there as well. And then for some adult relaxation time, we've got yoga, we've got Pilates, we've got aquasize, we've got kickboxing, and we actually are going to build on our activities program this coming year, adding in a lot more wellness activities. We've got a 7,000 square foot spa, and it's very much focused on women's health. So we've got a very unique women's health product line going on um, at the landings as well. We've got a full service um, gym, and that's all Cybex gym equipment in there as well. We actually added in an outdoor gym during COVID because a lot of guests don't want to use the indoor facility. They feel more comfortable using the outdoor facility. So we've got weights and we've got bikes down right by the, by the beach there. 
dining and entertainment, we've got three wonderful restaurants. We've got the All Day Beach Club, which is open for breakfast, lunch and dinner daily. We've got Callaloo Beach Restaurant, which is open daily for lunch. And then we've also got the Palms Indoor and Outdoor High End Dining. We're actually completely redesigning our menus at the moment. We're catering much more for an all inclusive guest as we do recognise that a lot more guests now do come on all inclusive. So we want to make it a very attractive proposition for those staying at the resort. So as I mentioned, we offer the two meal plans, bed and breakfast and all inclusive. And the all inclusive program comes complete with all meals, um, including the kids menus, it's cocktails, it's wines, it's beers by the glass. So it's a very comprehensive um, all inclusive plan there as well. Plenty to do for families in, in St Lucia. We've got um, Redwood Beach, we've got the big water park down there, we've got zip wiring. You can actually um, get a boat trip directly from the marina at, at um, the land is, we've got, got our own private marina, so they'll take you down to the pitons, you can swim on Sugar Beach. We've got the tram tours, you can go to La Soufrière and do the mud bath, so there really is so much to do for families on St Lucia. And I'll just show you a short video. And lastly, don't forget that we are part of the My Booking Rewards programme. So do go on and register for our programme. It's bluewatersresortrewards.com and landingsluciarewards.com. We've got double cash rewards for the Cove Suites for the summer at Blue Waters as well. So please do go on and log your bookings. And thank you very much. Over back over to you, Sarah. Thank you very much, Anna, and perfect timing too. <laughs> um, <laughs> okay, um, I think my computer's freezing now. Um, okay, so we've now left Antigua and St. Lucia, and we're moving across to Jade, who's jamming us to Jamaica. Jade, over to you. Hello, thank you. Just share my screen, sorry, one second. Okay, so hello everybody. Um, so Flyer Hotels and Resorts, I always just like to mention that first. So Hilton Rose Hall is part of the Flyer family um, and in which we have 19 hotels in three amazing destinations, Mexico, Dunrep and Jamaica. Today we will be focusing on Hilton Rose Hall, which is a fantastic family um, leading four and a half star all inclusive product. So just to give you a, an aerial shot there. What I love about it, especially for families, it's only located 15 minutes from Montego Bay Air, Montego Bay Airport. So there's not a long transfer after a very long flight from the UK. The location is wonderful. It's set on the sunny 18th century Rose Hall estate um, and it does have a private beach and it is just so pristine and wonderful. It's also home to Sugar Mills Water Park, um, which has lazy rivers, slides, uh, pools and swim up bars. So this is great for families and um, the adults and the kids and everybody enjoy this. I'll show you a little bit more about that later. Recent renovations also happened. Um, so they were all completed in October. And I think for those that are familiar with the property, um, you know, we did need to do some renovations and I'm happy to say that they've all been done now. Um, that was the guest rooms, the lobby um, and the pool areas and things like that, that were all updated. So just to show you some of those on the left there, you'll see what was the fresh restaurant and on the right, this is what it looks like now and the same with the lobby. Um, and I would just say, I mean, it looks even more Jamaican now than it did before. So that's always great. And then just the Luna restaurant, um, that's now the Rum Factory restaurant, which is such a unique concept. So you'll see along the back here, you can actually dine um, in a rum barrel, which is quite a unique experience and also really fun. And the coffee shop, it was kind of a small, um, a small shop there on the left. And as you can see now, it's, it's big and spacious, beautiful and has amazing views all around. And the bathroom. So this is um, just the extent of the renovations, I guess. The, the shower curtains that are quite horrific are now gone and we have modernised um, our bathrooms with the clear glass screens that you see there. 
just to show you a shot of this lovely pool um, because I love this and actually when when you're sitting in it or around it or swimming in it you can just see the ocean and everything it's such a wonderful spot to have a swimming pool um, the Sugar Mills Water Park, as I mentioned, um, it's got the water slides, the lagoons, waterfalls. I mean, you can just spend all day here and not get bored. You can get food from here, the jerk huts nearby, which I'll show you a little bit later. There's bars. You can just spend all day and not have to move, which is really quite nice. So we have a kids club here as well at Hilton Rose Hall. Um, so this is for ages four to 12. Um, and there's so much for children to do, um, act, act, even outside of the kids club. So the kids club is obviously there, but actually all of the activities that are going on around the resort all day for all ages, it's, it's a really uh, good vibe, this hotel. And there's always lots of activities going on for all ages. So this is our leading room type resort view. All of the rooms typically have the same layout. Um, it's the view that changes, but what you'll see is they're very bright um, and very modernized. All of our rooms, with the exception of the presidential suite, do sleep for people. So for families, um, you're going to need to interconnect the rooms, which we can do. The rooms will interconnect, um, which then gives you the maximum occupancy up to eight people. So I'll just show you the ocean view room there. Ocean front, these rooms are lovely, the views are amazing. Just gonna show you a short video. we were there with this hot weather today I know I do <laughs> so moving on to the restaurant so we have eight restaurants and um, there's so much choice for food here for everybody again that's great for families there is there's so much choice and somebody's going to love so many different options that we have and um, so the rum factory which you just saw in the renovation photos um, is our most updated restaurant um, which is Caribbean cuisine and this is open for dinner we have seaside restaurant and bar which is our seafood eatery and that is open for dinner as well Moonstone and his barbecue. This is Italian and Caribbean cuisine. Um, it's resort casual and it's open for lunch and dinner. The views there are so amazing. Um, this is definitely a great spot for dinner if you want to watch the sunsets. It's so, so beautiful. Fresh is our buffet Caribbean and international restaurant. So this is open for breakfast and for dinner. Jerk Hut, which is also amazing. Again, it's not far from the water park. So whenever I'm in the water park, I will always go and make my way over to the Jerk Hut and have some amazing Jamaican jerk chicken. Um, this is open for lunch. The Cricket Burger Bar is our American eatery. This is open for lunch and dinner. The Mangoes is our Caribbean and Asian restaurant, which is open for lunch and dinner. And Three Palms is our Italian restaurant. So this one does have a supplement. Um, so although it is in the hotel, um, it's a $15 per person um, charge to eat in this restaurant. Um, you can eat in here as many times as you want during your stay, um, but there will be that charge per person. Um, and it's complimentary for children under six. I'll just show you a short dining video. you can see lots and lots of lovely places to eat um, so this is where you can book at our resorts for most of our Pi resorts actually so just make a note for any of um, those partners in where you can access um, our resorts 
And that's all from me. I know that was really whizzed through, but just to mention obviously Fire Rewards, um, I know for those watching in the US, obviously you have your agent cash plus, but for Fire Rewards in the UK, um, you'll earn up to 15 pounds per booking for any of our Hilton properties. Um, and of course, any of our Fire properties um, in our family, you can earn up to 25 pounds per booking. So keep, keep those bookings coming and keep logging them and hopefully see you in Jamaica soon. Thank you. Brilliant. Thank you very much, Jade. It's always good to see um, Hilton Rose Hall. OK, so now we're leaving Jamaica and we're heading over to Graham. Graham, take us to Dominican Republic to impressive resorts. Let's see if we can get you up on, get you up on the screen. Oops, you don't Jade, see you can stop sharing. Yeah, I know. Just gonna... Jade, you need to stop sharing. Oh, sorry. I thought I did. Here we go. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks. Right. See if we can get you up. Sorry, get up there. Can you see that okay? It's just coming, it's just a little bit slow. Here we go, yep, all working. All good. Well, hi everybody, thanks for joining the webinar. And my name is Graham and I'm gonna tell you about the impressive results in Punta Cana. Uh, any questions, just save them to the end and uh, we'll do our best to answer them. Now this impressive brand is quite a new resort to the UK market. Um, it is quite new, but it is available through your preferred tour operators. Just give you an idea, gold medal, sunset, uh, holiday team, travel pack, two it's available through all those. And this is a family webinar, and I'm going to show you some pictures, and you can just imagine how much your family clients are going to enjoy the impressive brand. And what's even more impressive is the price point. There are some amazing offers out there. It's a five-star, all-inclusive resort but at the moment because it's new and it's launching in the uk market they really are just four star prices i did a price point check today and for a family of two adults and one child it was for the whole family all inclusive for a week in may 2023 it was only 2148 pounds for the whole family and if you've got two children it was only 2600 uh, for the whole family for the week including flights that's impressive to start off with. <laughs> hey, right. We're going to take you inside inside the resort now. So you arrive. It's just 20 minutes from the airport, international airport. And you arrive into the main reception area and you check in. Now, at this point, um, we do find that a lot of people do want to upgrade to our premium service. And you can do that actually uh, before they depart. And it's only about sort of 30, 40 dollars. Um, a day to upgrade to the premium and i'll show you exactly the benefits to upgrading for all your clients but my recommendation is to do it before they actually get it to resort as i say if you don't offer it over 60 percent of the clients will upgrade on arrival where you as could do it here in the uk and earn your commission now look at that can you imagine your clients or you because we do offer great agent rates and we're organizing fan trips we want to get you down there to enjoy it but can you imagine you or your clients sitting there looking at that beautiful scenery of the Caribbean. Wow, it's just amazing. Now the rooms, um, just the standard rooms alone are very, very large, over sort of 400 square feet of just pure luxury rooms. Remember, this is five-star accommodation in Domrep. It's considered a boutique hotel in Domrep because it, it's less than a thousand rooms in total and it's very spread out over 10 hectares of glorious flora and fauna land. But the rooms, the pools are just amazing. Just give you an idea, an overview of what's available. 10 restaurants, seven bars, <laughs> which is very nice. Uh, there's an array of domestic and imported beverages, three swimming pools, and of course your usual beach sports for the family and the children to play as well. And the, uh, the beach just had a $3 million renovation. So it looks amazing. And of course, being a family uh, show today, there's of course a great kids club and the teens as well. So that's all there. Let's go on with some pretty pictures. If you do upgrade your clients, that's what they're going to get. All our premium rooms are suites. So I just did another price check for an upgrade for less than £200 for the whole family um, in May next year. They can upgrade to the premium. That means two things. You get a very nice wristband and it tells all the other guests your premium and you've got more money than them. <laughs> um, so the rooms, the junior suites are super. Uh, again, um, they're over uh, 550 square feet, so they're very, very large. And some of the things you do get in your room, obviously, um, is the espresso machine, 
uh, pillow menu, but you also get your private entrance to um, the uh, individual lock-in, uh, sorry, check-in and lobby bar as well. And all the drinks that you order, once you've got that premium band on your wrist, uh, all the drinks you ever have are premium branded drinks. And there's also a private area on the beach. You get your own bellboy service and water, uh, waiter service on the beach. And you have exclusive um, bookings in the restaurants as well. So that's not bad. And I do highly recommend offer the upgrade facility to the clients when you book it. Now, when you're actually in resort, again, oh, I just want to dive in that pool. I know it's a hot day here, but you just can imagine diving in that pool. You can see a family enjoying themselves there, right on the beach. There are free swim pools around the resort. There's a nice family sized pool, a kiddies pool, um, and an adult only pool. So, you know, if you do want to get away, I did another price check for September this year. If you're an agent or you know your clients want to come down there, it was only uh, £950 for a week with flights. So, very, very competitive pricing on the impressive brand. So, make sure you do book it, you know where to book it. We are here to help you, contact us. Um, and look, over the, the 10 restaurants, three of them are exclusively on the beach. Imagine having a beautiful meal there with your loved one and just uh, gazing into the beautiful sunsets. You're on the right side with amazing sunsets in Punta Cana. But it is all about the beach down there. So you can see it's around about a mile long, this beach, the El Colector Beach. Uh, in Barrio is about a mile long. It's one of the only uh, blue flag beaches in the whole area of Punta Cana. There's only four on the island and we are one of them. As I say, so had over three million dollars spent on it quite recently. Beautiful uh, sand, but it's also great for families, kids, non-swimmers, because it's a very slow indent into the sea as well. So it's ideal. Plus we've got a unique pier. You can see in the background there, that's a unique pier, the only one in Domrep and it's great people have their meals on it they can actually go out and watch the sunsets have a few cocktails but its primary use is for weddings so it's quite an unusual place uh, to get married on the end of a pier but it's there and available at the impressive brand resorts just give you another aerial shot of the beach itself and two things you should pick up on this image is the restaurants right at the front as I say we've got three premium restaurants right on the beaches front um, there, but if you have a look at the whole area, the whole area is resolved. See the flora and fauna, lots of shade, beautiful palm trees. So you really do know you're in the Caribbean. Um, but there's no concrete jungle. You can see it. It's low rise, no high rises at all, no lots of concrete. And um, it's very flora and fauna, beautiful shaded, great sunbathing areas as well. And it's very easy to walk out of the resort. And there's a small village just a few yards to the right as you come out. So if you do want to leave the resort for any reason, um, you can do go a bit of uh, um, shopping very, very close. And if you are upgraded to the premium, you do have your private beach area with your sun lounges, your hammocks, your bar service. There's a, an individual bar for premium guests called the Tiki Bar, um, and you get your service there. Remember, it's all inclusive, so you don't have to pay for these nice glass of champers sitting on the beach. Whoa, I could go there right now. And as I say, there are flora and fauna around. So if anybody does like to walk around resorts, there's plenty of space, um, nice sort of um, seating areas to have your afternoon tea and just enjoy the beautiful Caribbean um, resort of the impressive brands. And as you say, it's a family webinar today. So of course we've got the family uh, kiddies club as well. So lots of things to do. There's a, a team of uh, animators down there in kiddies Rex, all qualified, all trained. And they really do look forward to receiving the children and the families uh, down there. Great little kids room, playroom. They do a bespoke activities program for your children if needed. And of course, there's a teen hangout place as well. So if you go down there and your kids are teenagers, they don't want to actually join the kiddies club. There's a separate teen area and a, a social side for them to join in as well. And of course, uh, mom and dad, there's six, seven nights of entertainment there. My favorite place personally when I go down is the gym. I like to have a workout every morning, usually on the buffet bar, but uh, sometimes I do go down to the gym and there's a great full-size gymnasium down there, but well, that's crazy enough to do it. But there's also a beautiful spa. No five-star luxury resort is complete without having a, a beautiful spa. 
And this one is right on the beach again. You've got some great treatment rooms there with fantastic views. And there's an array of menu of treatments that your clients can choose from as well. Um, and there's an indoor hydrotherapy pool as well. Oh, where's my booking form? I want to go. There you go. And weddings, if uh, we're talking about families, but maybe couples do want to get married. Uh, a lot of people want to get married on the beach, and we can do that. We're only one wedding today. Uh, um, so the focus is entirely on here earlier on. Um, if anybody wants to get married on the pier, they can do that as well. The whole day is completely focused on the couple. So uh, we get the pier shot up that we did earlier. Yeah. It, yeah, there we go. There's the pier where your clients can get married if they so wish. Now, if you do want to, oops, it's gone a bit blank. There's me again. Can you see that? Are you still hearing me, Sarah? Oh, I can hear you. Okay, I can just see you. Uh, a message that to all the agents there. there. If you, um, do want to book it? We are part of the MBR Rewards Program. Great price points. Contact us at sales at uh, Impressive Results uh, UK and we can get back to you on that. And don't forget, if you are part of the MBR family and you're coming to the Peaks uh, Conference uh, next week, I believe it is, Sarah. Uh, it's on Monday, yes. On Monday. If over you 200 are, people going. If you are coming and you see me there, do come up to me and say, Graham, would you like a drink? And we can talk about the old days that we never had. Now, come up and see me and we'll buy you a drink and have a great time. All right, that's Super. all from Impressive. Start booking and we'll see you down there very soon. Okay, thank you very much. Okay, so um, we have got a couple of questions that have come in. I know Anna's been busy answering hers. Um, Jade, um, Ushma's asked, is a sugar mill water park access included in the room cost? It is, yes. It's part of the all-inclusive. Super duper. Jade, how many adults are allowed in a room and what age are you considered an, an adult? I can't even speak today. An adult. <laughs> that was me earlier. Um, so our room types can take four adults, actually, um, a maximum of three children. The children age is three to 12. So an adult would be classed from 13 plus. But four adults okay. can actually fit in these room types, which is quite unusual, I would say. Super. Um, Rachel's asked, do you have seagrass issues? Uh, we don't. No, not at the moment anyway. No, we're usually quite, quite lucky. There's not any alarming issues with seaweed at the moment. OK, super. Um, I think this one from Tammy is for you, Graham, because it was once you had started. Um, she said, is the nightly entertainment? Yes, I did mention it. it's a minimum of six nights, professional entertainment. Um, and the result, there's a casino there, there's a nightclub there. The nightclub is partly all inclusive as well. So you can drink 24-7 uh, if you wish. Um, but the casino, you do have to pay yourself. Super. Thank you very much. Graham, what are the kids club times, please? Uh, from early morning to dusk. Um, it's as simple as that. Remember, we're very bespoke. Um, if the kids want to be there early, it, it's usually from 8 a.m. basically. OK, super. Um, Tammy's asked what beach is your hotel on, but I think you then covered that later um, with it being Punta Cana. Yeah, El Crito Beach. It's on Berrio uh, Resort. Okay. Do you have umbrellas on the beach? Uh, it doesn't rain. Nice. <laughs> For the shade. I know, yeah, there's umbrellas. <laughs> there are umbrellas. Yeah, they're, they're all included as well. Super duper. Thank you very much. OK, so I think that's all of the questions, unless there's been any in chat that I have missed. Um, let's have a look. No, I think I think we're good. If I've missed anything, pop them into the Q&A quickly. Um, OK, so every single person that's on the webinar today is entered into the prize draw. Um, however, if you want to win 10 entries into the prize draw, um, which is a spin to win where I put everybody's names in, you have to be the first person to get the correct answer. So each of our hosts are going to ask you a question um, and they will have covered it during the presentation unless they're really mean and then they wouldn't have covered it through the presentation. Mm. But I think our guys are they're pretty good. Um, so if everybody can go to chat for me. And just make sure that your drop down says everyone. 
Um, just while you're all doing that, um, guys, um, Kamel's asked, do any of your resorts have an adult only section? So Graham, go first. Uh, uh, yes. Yes. Anna? Adults only pool at, um, at Blue Waters. There's an adults only pool at Landings as well, but not adults okay. only restaurants as such. Okay, super. And Jade? Yeah, no, we don't. It's for all ages, everything at our property. Yeah. Brilliant. Thank you very much. Sorry, that was just a quick one that had just come in. Um, okay, so if everybody is ready, um, Jade, would you like to go first? Yep. Okay. Oh, so we. Yep. So we recently had some renovations done at the property, as you uh, saw, and I would like the name of the updated Caribbean restaurant, please. Oh, that's a hard one. We've got some right answers. Have we? Yeah. I can never remember the names of restaurants. Um, okay, so would the rum factory, is that correct? Correct, yes. You got lots of correct answers. So that was Matt, <laughs> who was the quickest on that one. Super. Well done, Matt. You're entered 10 well times. Okay. Anna. I seem to have gone into a ghost again. I don't know why. You have. Um, okay. So my question is, how many adults and children do the Cove Suites accommodate? Up to how many? Okay, we've got a <laughs> complete mix here. So there was so, some correct. So we, it's, I, I will take either four or two and two. Okay, so Shauna was the first person with four, um, and then Ushma, two, two and two, but Shauna was before. So Shauna, just writing all your names down. Okay, and Mr. Graham. Uh, easy question. How many um, swimming pools are there at the impressive brand in Punta Cana? <laughs> are you swearing at me, Graham? Yeah, just scratching my head. <laughs> um, I think the answer to that will be maybe three. <laughs> Amazing, yeah. Amazing. And so my, Michael was the first the person. Got water in them, which is good. All of them have water as well. Fantastic. Yeah, yeah. it's a bonus. The winning combination. Okay, so we're over quite early today, but we've had some amazing presentations. Um, don't forget that every single person here is completely trade friendly and wants to work with you. Um, so definitely, definitely support them. If you've got any further questions, let them know. Um, I will send a follow up with the copy of the recording and um, Graham, Anna and Jade's contact details so you can reach out to them with any further questions. Um, and a big, 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 massive thank you to you all for joining us. Um, for those of you that are at Peaks in London on Monday, we will see you there. Um, anything to add, guys? No, I'm looking forward to it. Thanks, Sarah, for your support and organisation today's webinar. Thank you very much. No problem. You're very, very thank welcome. Thank you for having thank us. Thank you. You're very welcome. So we'll see you all next week and we'll see you at Peaks on Monday if you are attending. So big thank you, everybody. And thank you guys for coming on. It's much appreciated. We love your presentations. Thanks, Thanks guys. a lot. Bye-bye. Bye, everybody. Bye.